Motorola's Droid Turbo takes almost everything we liked about the new Moto X and gives it a surprise specs boost less than two months later. This Verizo exclusive Android phone has a 5.2 inch Quad HD display, the latest Snapdragon processor, 3GB of RAM, a 21 megapixel camera, and an astounding two days of battery life. Yes, there's a catch or two. The Droid Turbo price is twice as much as the Moto X and it's not available outside of Verizo. Sorry, at NT, Sprint or T-Mobile customers. Droid Turbo Back Cover Motorola has another pure Android winner on its hands that's more powerful than its previous offering. But its limited availability and more expensive price make it this year's sleeper hit. Key Features Droid Turbo runs Android 4.4 KitKat and the upgraded ingredients are appropriately packed together like an oversized S more into a Cardibar style smartphone. Front and center is a Quad HD display. It measures out to be the same 5.2 inches as the Moto X second generation, but this Super AMOLED screen is four times the resolution at 1440x2560. This isn't quite as enticing as the new Motorola made Google Nexus 6 that is 6 inches but it's one of the best one-handed smartphone screens next to the 5.1-inch Samsung Galaxy S5. Droid Turbo Features What the Droid Turbo display does have over the fancy Nexus 6 is the Moto Active Display, not the less functional ambient light sensor. By waving one hand over the Droid Turbo, I was able to wake the device in a limited state. This allowed me to see the current time and notification icons in white. The rest of the display remained unlight, saving battery life in the long run. The middle layer of the Droid Turbo upgrades almost all of its internals. The Snapdragon 805 processor is the newest and fastest chip that Qualcomm is currently putting in smartphones. It's joined by 3GB of RAM and either 32GB or 64GB of internal storage. Motorola and Verizo aren't wasting your time by keeping around a 16GB model of this carrier exclusive phone. Battery Life the back layer to this S more like sandwich features a giant 3900mAh battery. It gives Droid Turbo its name and powers the phone for two days, according to Motorola. We still have to run our own tests to verify this claim and we will update this review page with the results. Moto X, left, vs Droid Turbo, center, vs Nexus 6, right. That's twice as long as the Moto X and several hours better than the large and therefore more energy consuming Nexus 6. To top it off. Droid Turbo comes with a turbocharger that can juice up the battery from a critical state with 6 hours of battery life in just 15 minutes. Camera The Droid Turbo camera is another upgrade that deserves further testing. It has an advanced number-pleasing 21-megapixel sensor compared to Moto X's 13-megapixel snapper. Initial photos came back with a larger 5248x2952 resolution and an average of 4.6 megabytes per picture but tones were oversaturated vs the more true-to-life pictures shot with the Nexus 6. Droid Turbo Camera Review Everything has so far resembled the Moto X's Instagram-like prism that makes my life look a whole lot punchier and colorful than it really is. It saves a step on Instagram, but doesn't look good for all subjects. And unlike the Facebook-owned app, you won't find a hash no filter option. Droid Turbo can take 4 Kelvin video at 24 FPS in addition to normal 1080p at 30 FPS and slow motion 720p video. There's no external storage via a micro SD card slot, so unless you own a 4 Kelvin TV, the best quality video is limited in playback and you hit the 32 GB model cap awfully quick. Droid Turbo Review Dimensions Droid Turbo Review Design all three upgraded layers the screen, internal specs and battery are soldered together with a subdued metal frame and three unique back cover choices. This is where the Droid Turbo design really contrasts with the large, contoured frame of the Nexus 6 and the customizable Moto Maker designs of the Moto X. Instead of plastic backs in every color imaginable or premium wood and leather finishes, this Verizo phone has a trio of rear options, Kevlar infused material glass fiber in black or red, or a bumpy ballistic nylon in black. The Droid Turbo review unit I received has the black materialized Kevlar cover that's smooth, but features a non-slip finish. It should hold up better than the supple leather back of the Moto X that took a beating in just two days in my pocket. Droid Turbo is less bold, yet the dimensions are a little bigger. The curved design juts out to 0.44 in. At its thickest point vs Moto X is 0.39 in. Droid Turbo battery life. It also has a bottom chin thanks to dedicated, as opposed to on-screen, buttons for a height of 5.65 in.
VS Moto X is 5.5 in. The turbo's width is almost the same 2.89 in. VS X is 2.85 in. Availability and price. The Droid Turbo release date was October the 30th, having launched in Verizo stores and on the official Motorola website. Don't hold your breath if you're on a different carrier or outside of the US. It's strictly locked down to Verizo with no chance of coming to other networks. Droid Turbo Verizo. It's not a tough sell if you're already on or switching to Verizo. Droid Turbo costs a standard $200 on contract. Without the two-year agreement, you will be paying a steeper $600 up front. That's double the price of the $100 Moto X 2014 on contract and just $50 less than the very similar Nexus 6 that comes with a supersized 6-inch display and Android 5.0 lollipop. Early verdict. Droid Turbo takes the Moto X to a new level with better specs in the front, middle and back. Its Quad HD display looks better, internal specs get to tasks faster and the battery lasts longer. You really can't beat two days of battery life on a 5.2-inch phone. Yes, it has a slightly more subtle design in a side-by-side -side comparison. Thanks for watching my video. Subscribe my YouTube channel for more latest updates.